Tigre, you guys got, <coughs> excuse me, got, got some takeaways, obviously. How, how big is that, and, and is that a sign of things to come? Yeah, it's big. You know, that's since Coach Allen been here, that's been one of our main principles of what we do is getting takeaways. So just seeing that last game was huge. It had been a little frustrating that you guys had, been some, had come so close and not been able to get it until then. Like so close to getting takeaways? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, that's just sometimes how the ball falls or and things like that. So, you know, you just got to keep attacking at the ball and hopefully it ends up in your hand or something like that. So it ended up in the right hands this game. Looking at Penn State, uh, I mean, Coach Allen talked. I think he said they were the best quarterback running back duo going right now. Um, early thoughts about trying to slow them down and what, what are you guys thinking about? Um, we just got to play sound defense, you know. They got a great tight end, too. So it's just one of those deals where we got to buy in, watch film, and um, just prepare our best and hope for the best. And in terms of Penn State, obviously last year was a tight game. You guys did slow down the offense. How much can you take from a game like that uh, going into this week? You can take a lot. And I don't even, and not even talking scheme, just the way we was flying around. And that's what you got to do against this team, just with their athletes. So just flying around to the ball and um, rally tackling. When you have a running back like that who's just elusive, quick, strong, all these different qualities, one of the best in the country, I mean, is it about penetration, getting to him It's quicker? about flying to the ball. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? He break one tackle, somebody else got to be there. You know, you just can't let him get his foot, his feet in the ground, make cuts. You know, we got to fly, fly, fly. How do you tackle a guy like that? I mean, it's just got to fly to the ball. <laughs> Sense of theme here. Yeah, that's all it is. You just want to play fast, and that's the main thing. I mean, he's going to make people miss. That's what his qualities are. We got to be great tacklers and just effort. Were you guys watching the Iowa game the other night? Yeah. What did you, you think just watching them on TV? Just seems was, like... I knew it was going to be a good game. I like Iowa defense. I, I keep in touch with their linebacker and things like that. So I knew it was going to be a good game, and, and it was fun to watch and the way they finish and things like that. How much harder is it to prepare for a guy like Saquon, who great in the running game, but I think he's also leading the Big Ten in receiving yards right now? Yeah, he, that's just one of his qualities. You know, they release him out the backfield, and, and when he catches the ball, it's, he's making plays again. So it's just one of those deals where we got to lock in on our keys and fly around. Would you have to, and I guess you do, he likes to leap over would-be tacklers. So as you're tackling, you have to Flip not to get ball. Just, but not get too low? <laughs> if somebody go low, he jumps. Somebody got to be there to clean him up up top. And that's our theme, fly to the ball. Huh. And you stick with that theme very well. You got to. As far as that, that QB running back duo, yeah. does seeing JT Barrett and, and J.K. Dobbins in week one kind of help deal with that? Yeah, yeah, that's another great combination that we did go against. But this team give you different looks and, and, and scheme is different. So it's just one of those things, like I said, we got to watch film and come up with a great game plan. Alan Stallings filled in for Greg Gooch in the first half of the Georgia Southern game this past Saturday. Just what were your thoughts on what he brought to the front seven while you know Greg had to miss that first half? Yeah, um, all week at practice, you can tell he was locked in. And it's good for Gooch, too, for um, helping him out and preparing. So, you know, we know what he can do, and he stepped up to the plate.